Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So it seems that Microsoft is working on a redesigned keyboard manager for the Power Toys utility app. And Power Toys, as you may well know, can be downloaded from the Microsoft Store for both Windows 10 and Windows 11. And the keyboard manager, currently, if you are using Power Toys, you may well know that it helps you to reconfigure your keyboard by remapping keys and shortcuts. So basically, you can assign and rearrange keys and keyboard shortcut combinations. And with the tool turned on, you can remap a key by clicking on this link. And this lets you then uh, go through that process. And then you can remap a shortcut. And the same applies. Now, this is currently what it looks like in the stable version of Power Toys, which is currently sitting on version 0.76. And as spotted by Desk Modder, as mentioned, it seems that the keyboard manager may be getting a bit of a visual redesign layout change. So if we just head over to a screenshot provided by Desk Modder, and it's still early days, but this will give us a general idea as to what Microsoft is working on with this new redesigned um, layout uh, for the keyboard manager. Now, yeah, we can see a couple of different things. We can see at the top here, uh, we have remapping, so we have our original keys. Then we have the new keys that you've selected, and here's the applicable apps that um, will be launched. And obviously, you can toggle each of these um, different sh shortcuts on and off. And then at the top here, you've got a selection of different items like programs. So you can um, s select and assign programs, apps, text, and URLs. And I actually quite like the look of this new layout. I think it just puts everything more into focus and context where the previous layout or the current layout um, kind of seems to be a little bit kind of all over the place for want of a better word. And if we head to the next screenshot provided, um, this is just a GIF with the whole process in action, which will give us a general idea more or less what to expect. So as mentioned, you've got uh, better menus and dialogues. It looks a little bit more like the... Um, fluent design layout changes that we see in windows 11 because microsoft has been focusing on bringing a more windows 11 uh, user interface into power toys as i have posted and the good news is that um you can launch uh, the different um shortcuts for those different apps or um, programs apps and so on you can launch them minimized or maximized which I think is a nice move in the right direction. And at this stage, uh, there's no word from Microsoft when this will actually roll out to the general public. Um, it's still very early days, and a lot of these features at this stage are currently placeholders, so there's quite a little bit of work still to do. And yeah, we can see what the keyboard manager, as mentioned, looks like in the stable version, which is currently sitting on version 0.76.2, which rolled out a couple of weeks ago. So Microsoft is quite... Um, consistent with the uh, power toys updates so i'm sure that we will be getting a update to power toys soon but at this stage it's not known um, if the new keyboard manager redesign and layout change will make it into the next version but obviously if you are using power toys and would be interested i'll keep you posted if and when that does happen so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one